Unit 4. Develop and extend SB theory for SB Business 1 with Service Layer. Part 1. Overview of SB theory connecting to Service Layer. We have already gone through the architecture overview of SB Business 1 for SB on HANA. In the last unit, we have learned how to create a theory app using HANA XO data. In this unit, we are going to learn how to create a theory app using the service layer assessing the business logic in business one. There's a couple of challenges to create a theory app connecting to the service layer. First of all, as of B1H 9.2 patch 08, the service layer support all data version 3.0. While well, the build to me and SP Web ID as well as the SAP UI5, they support all data version 2.0. And that means the theory app you create with build to me and SP Web ID will be not able to connect to the service layer directly. There was two reasons. First of all, the mismatch of all data version here. Secondly, the service layer will require authentication. So it means before you get the sales order object and you need to log in first. And then there was a two solution to adjust um, these challenges. Option number one, we can create a theory app and then involving the service at JavaScript and then the service at JavaScript what are calling the service layer. There was a blog about this approach as well as the sample code available in the blog. Or either we can create the SAP Fiori app and using the client side JavaScript, calling the service layer directly. Option number one. So here we are introduced a generic S a service side JavaScript proxy. Uh, to call service layer, to log in, to get the sales order, to create the sales order, um, to patch the sales order, something like that. And then as you can see the architecture here, the theory app in the service side JavaScript, they will be hosted in the HANA exchange. And then when the, uh, the client um, browser uh, running the theory app, and the theory app make a call to service side JavaScript first. To log in and to get the sales order. And then the service side JavaScript would make outgoing HTTP call to the service layer to log in or to uh, to post uh, a sales order or to update uh, to patch uh, to update the sales order in this case. And all the data model uh, we are using here is a JSON data model. And as we know, the JSON data model can um, be bound with the user control in SAP UI5 in our theory app here. And then the benefit we have in here is there such as no cross origin resource sharing issue. Option number two, we have created a theory app and connect to the service layer directly. Here we're going to use in a jQuery to make the uh, post to the login in the service layer or to get the sales order to post the sales order to create it. And however, pay attention to here, uh, because the theory app will be hosting in the uh, HANA exchange. Well, and the service layer will be another um, another server domain, even though they're in the, in the same HANA box, but they belong to different uh, web server here. So uh, in order to uh, overcome the cross domain issue here, we will need to enable the uh, course setting in the service layer uh, here. Here you have in the block for how to enable the course in the service layer for details. And the same, when we call in the service layer, um, the service layer will return the JSON uh, data uh, to the theory app. And the theory app, we're using a JSON data model and bounding with the uh, theory you, um, user control here. 
And here was the sample uh, theory app, which for uh, checking the sales order and for the order open sales order and uh, close the sales order and cancel the sales order. Let's have a look at, at the demo. Here I have a theory app, and so this one is based using the server-side JavaScript to connect the service layer. First of all, uh, we are going to have in the login page uh, to the service layer. When I click the login uh, in the background, you are using the server-side JavaScript uh, to involve service layer to do the login. Once I have been authenticated uh, by the service layer, and then I will make the second call uh, right after that to get all of the open sales order. And as you can see, this theory app is still a uh, uh, master detailed uh, theory app. It's showing all of the open source world on the list. When I select one of them, in the, in the detail view, you're showing me the details. And the RGS and dog date, dog total, as well as the line details uh, for this sales order. Uh, I'm, the customer cancel the sales order. So let's say let's go to cancel the sales order. And then when I click the cancel here in the background, again you are involving the service side JavaScript and the service side JavaScript or calling make an outgoing uh, HTTP call to the service layer to cancel the sales order. Okay. That's the end of the unit four part one to create a VR app for with, with the service layer. We have learned the challenge of the theory of connecting the service layer direct, uh, directly, as well as two approaches, how to adjust these challenges. Thank you for your time.